People in Elmira had a chance to speak out about their neighborhood tonight, and they certainly had a lot to say. Yes, they did. The neighborhood meeting was organized by 6th District Councilman Bill McCarthy to try and tackle some of the issues they are facing. WNY HG's Kelly Meyer was at the meeting and joins us live in the studio with a, uh, with a story. Kelly, it seems like the meeting got a little heated. People were fired up tonight, Jennifer. They talked about everything from police to parking, and they all want to see the same thing, to see their neighborhood get better. Bethany Lutheran Church in Elmira filled up tonight. They even had to grab more chairs to make room for some very concerned neighbors. It's hard to pinpoint their biggest concern. The group of about 30 had a different issue they wanted to bring up. They talked about everything from cat infestation to noisy neighbors. Some were upset about neighborhood upkeep, one renovated home next to a vacant one. Others were angry that there is nowhere to park, some having up to five cars per household. Sixth District Councilman Bill McCarthy organized the meeting tonight and brought in Captain Collins from the Elmira Police Department to hear the concerns as well. They both encouraged neighbors to not be afraid to speak out and to use the anonymous tip line. Mark Young was one of the neighbors at the meeting and said what he just wants to see is a change. They did a good job in explaining the situation. So I was glad to be here. This, we've lived here for 30 years and we don't want to move. So we really want to see our neighborhood get better, not worse. People aren't neighborly like they used to be. So that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to bring people back together and, and work with each other. McCarthy will look into ways to take care of some of the issues, stricter parking regulations, more police patrols, and a crackdown on crime. No word yet on the next meeting, but Young told me he's hopeful the tides will turn. Kelly Meyer, WENY HD News.